Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am so excited about this because we are going to be doing my very first ever Creepy Crate unboxing. So for those of you who have never heard of Creepy Crate and you don't know what Creepy Crate is, for a subscription service where bi-monthly you get a box full of goodies, limited edition collectibles, there's a book in every box, it is $39.99 every other month and free shipping. I am so excited about this. A few of you guys have told me to get into Creepy Crate and do unboxings on my channel because you guys said that they are something that I would really like. So I'm very very excited to see what my first impressions are going to be on this box. They were kind enough to reach out to me to do this unboxing and they also gave me a coupon code for you guys to use if you want to try Creepy Crate for yourself. So we are going to open this up. We are going to see what goodies we get. Oh my god, I am so excited! First of all, Look at how cute the box is. And it has all these like really cool things. Like I love this right here with the hand with like the bones all exposed. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get to unboxing this Creepy Crate box. I swear to God, I get more lipstick on my teeth than I do on my actual lips. It's, it's ridiculous. All right, so I cut the box open. So let's go ahead and open it up. Oh my goodness. Right when I open it up, here is what I see right on top. It looks like we have a bunch of worms, as a graveyard girl would say. So we get like a little card that basically tells us everything that you get in this box. So I'm not going to read this because I kind of want to be surprised. Next thing that we have in here is a card and I think this is like promoting a book or a movie. I could be wrong. And the next thing I see, which is really kind of cool actually, is it looks like we have a pair of gloves. Super, super cool, literally right up my alley. They do look a little big, so I honestly don't know if they're going to fit me, but they look so cute. Here are what these gloves look like. Oh my God, these are so freaking cool. It's also really cool because it is winter right now where I live, so these would actually come in handy. Oh my god, I love that. And you could use these for Halloween, you could use these for winter, you could use these any time of year basically. And it'd be cool if you like cut the um, tips off and you had like your real fingers poking out. So that's the first thing we got. Really, really cool. And they are smartphone compatible it looks like because it has like the little thingies right here. But wow, these are super, super cool. The next thing we have in here is a little pin. And this one's kind of cool, but it is like a devil, a devil head pin. So yeah, that's the next little thing we got, a cute little pin. I actually have a bag where I have a bunch of band patches sewn onto it and a bunch of pins, and this would actually look really, really cute on that. So I have the perfect place for that already. Let's see, the next thing we have in here is the book, and there is a book in every single creepy crate. So here is what the book looks like. This is the one that we got, Stoker's Wild. I think that's how you say that. And this looks like a pretty big book, and I'm not much of a book reader. It is a pretty thick book, but the words don't look too super small, so it looks like something I might try. If you guys have ever read this book, let me know down in the comments, did you like it? Would I like it? Is it scary? Okay, the next thing we have in here, it looks like a couple shot glass. Dude, what? These are so freaking cool. I'm definitely gonna give one to my sister because we kind of have like, me, my mom, and my sister kind of have an inside joke with this, but each shot glass, hopefully you can see that okay, is from The Shining, and it is the two twins that make themselves known to Danny. This one is like their black silhouette and it says, come play with us. And then on the next one, kind of like a creepy white ghost out version of them. And it says forever and ever. These are so cute. They are glass, so they are really good quality. Oh my God, these are so cool. I'm gonna have to show these to my sister and my mom. They're both just gonna die laughing. I love it. All right, the next thing we got in here, oh, this is kind of cute. It came in this little bag right here, and it looks like a little voodoo doll, and I think this is one of those, um, what the heck are they called? The squishies? I know Graveyard Girl. Oh, it's scented! Why the heck can't I think of that smell? It's gonna drive me nuts. 
But yeah, it's one of those like little squishies where you basically can squish them as small as you want it and then it slowly goes back into shape. Here's what this cute little guy looks like. Oh my gosh, I really, really like it. Oh, and as I'm like reading this little sheet right here, this little pin that I thought was a devil is actually supposed to be Krampus. So that's a fun little fact. I thought it was just Satan, so. I guess Krampus looks like Satan. All right, and I think we have one more item in this creepy crate box, and this one I'm actually super excited about, and this is a 2020 cryptids calendar. It looks like this right here, and then on the back, it just shows you pictures, a bunch of old stories that people have told, like we have the Loch Ness Monster over here. It looks like we have Bigfoot, we have a Kraken or a giant squid right here. So here is what January of 2020 looks like, for example, and it is the Kraken. And what I think is really cool is it kind of gives a little bit of a backstory of each monster. I always do this with calendars. Let me know if you guys do the same, but I always go to my birthday month just to see which one that I have. So August 2020 is the Kangamato. There's what mine is. It looks like a flying dinosaur. And I will be 27 on the 23rd. So my birthday is on a Sunday. So it says, in 1957, a man entered a hospital in Zambia's Fort Roseberry, claiming to have been attacked by a large bird-like creature that left him with a severe chest wound. The patient's drawing of his attacker closely resembled the details of the Kangamato. So that is really cool right there. And then as I'm looking at this card right here, this is actually an ebook download card. So you can go and download this on your Kindle. And I'm looking down the list here and it looks like we got everything in this box. So really, really exciting, you guys. I had a lot of fun doing this. I think my first ever Creepy Crate unboxing was a success. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have ever tried Creepy Crate. Do you enjoy them? What is your favorite thing about them? Thank you so much, Creepy Crate, for letting me try one of your boxes. I hope we can do it again in the future. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you go down, give this video a huge thumbs up. If you want to try Creepy Crate for yourself, I will have a coupon code right at the top of the description box if you want to give it a go. Also, if you are new to my channel and this is the first video of mine that you are seeing, make sure you go down and hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future videos. But as always, I will see you guys very soon in my next video. I love you guys and stay creepy. Bye!